Walruses are now gathering on low-lying islands. They gave birth on sea ice, but with this platform now gone, they need a new place to haul out and nurse their young. After several days at sea, the male bear finally makes landfall, drawn by pungent smells emanating from the island. <laughs> By the end of summer, the bear has lost half his weight. With the ice long gone, he is forced onto land in search of food. There will be no easy meals on this island. Walruses are the largest seals in the world. They weigh over a ton and are armed with tusks a meter long. Exhausted from his swim, the bear must regain his strength. The next day, a sea fog shrouds the island. The Wallaces sense that they're in danger. Using the fog as cover, the bear approaches the herd. The adults close ranks around their young, presenting a wall of blubber and hide. He tests the barrier, but it stands firm. It appears that the world's largest land carnivore has met his match. There must be a chink in the armor somewhere. Not here. This female walrus is shielding her pup if he can just prize her off. The bear's claws and teeth can't penetrate her thick hide. With the herd retreating to water, the bear must move quickly. Having failed with one, he heads straight for another. The chance of his first meal in months is slipping away. seems increasingly desperate. It's now or never. He must avoid the stabbing tusks if he's to win. The flailing walrus is immensely powerful and drags the bear away from the shallows towards the safety of the herd. slips from his grasp. Only at the height of summer, when bears are on the verge of starvation, will they risk attacking such dangerous prey. It was a gamble that this bear took and lost. The stab wounds he received from the walrus are so severe that he can barely walk. The 
Wallace's are calm again, seemingly aware that the injured bear no longer poses a threat to them or their young. Unable to feed, this bear will not survive. If the global climate continues to warm and the Arctic ice melts sooner each year, it's certain that more bears will share this fate.